This is the shark bite angle stop quarter turn. One side it can connect to half inch either copper or PEX and there's a stop you can control the water flow or shut it off open up and the other side you can connect it to the pipe tube like this actually it's best for using for the toilet water supply so the water line will be coming like this and then this is connect to the toilet in this video i'm going to show you how to connect this valve to the PEX water supply tube and connect it to the toilet water supply tube on the other side. Let's get started. Let's take a closer look on this valve. Here there's a tool. Actually, this is for the removal. We don't need this when we install, but I recommend you keep it just in case you want to remove. I will show you how to disconnect them later. So let's look inside. Right in the middle, there's a plastic inner tube. When you install packs, the inner tube must be inside and it can be put inside the packs. And you will see the metal teeth all the way around. This teeth will grab the packs or copper. And then inside, there's the o ring. The o ring actually seal the pipe. So let's connect it. First step, put the inner tube inside. And it must be lined up. You will feel the resistance. Now you're touching the metal teeth. So push in. And now you pass the metal teeth. You're touching the O-ring. You need to keep pushing until this line reaching here. Okay, now it's been fully pushed in. So that's why you need a mark, you know where you're at. Now the end of the packs is right here. So the O-ring is here. Now it's fully sealed. It can be a turned a little bit. So here's the valve, we'll control the water flow. Then let's connect the toilet supply. We don't need this one. Take this off. And then we connect here. It's very convenient that you have a little valve right here. So every time if you want to fix the toilet or you just replace the toilet, you don't need to shut off the whole house water supply or if you live in a condo, it's more complicated. So if you really want to disconnect, or you want to change the whole thing. So here is the tool. The way to disconnect it is to push this part against the plastic. It will open up the metal teeth and at the same time, take the PEX tube out. Let's do this. I hope this video is helpful. Thank you for watching.